If the perimeter of a rectangle is 54 centimeters and the area is 180 square centimeters, then what are the dimensions of the rectangle? All right, so we know what a rectangle looks like. And perimeter simply means to add up all the sides. So perimeter is 2w plus 2l. And we also know that the area is 180, and area is length times width. So with that, we have enough information that we can find um, the length and the width. <clears throat> um, however, we're going to have to do a little bit of algebra to get there. So if we take, um, say, the LW equal to 180, and we solve for L, doesn't matter which way you go, but we divide both sides by W, we get that L is 180 over W. Oh. So let me squish these up a little bit and move them. All right, now I can take that and plug it in for L, and my perimeter formula. So we have 2w equals 2 times 180 over w, not equals, plus. That all equals 54. And we go ahead and we solve it for w. Now, to get solve for w, we need to get it out of the um, denominator. So I'm going to multiply both sides of the equation by w to do that. So we get, distributing, we get 2w squared plus, now the w's on the second one are going to divide out, and we just get 2 times 180, which is 360. That equals 54w. Since we have a quadratic here, we want everybody to be on the same side, so I'm going to subtract that 54w over. All right, so our equation equals zero now. And um, I need some more workspace. Yeah, that's good. All right, um, I notice everything can be divided by two on both sides. So I'm going to get w squared minus 27w plus 180. Now at this point we should be able to factor and solve these. Um, so let's think here. We got uh, 180. We need factors of 180 that add up to negative 27. We know they're going to both have to be negative. So if we start looking at some factors of uh, 180, um, yeah, so let's just push that out of the way for now. So 180 can be divided by 2, so 2 times um, 90, um, or 90 times 2, and then also we can do 20 times 9. That'll work as well. Um, we can do 3 times 60, or... Um, 30 times 6. We can do 4. It goes into 4 45 times. Uh, goes into 5. Um, let's see, 5. 180 divided by 5 is 36. That's getting closer to what we want. Um, if we subtracted well, they both have to be negative, so that, yeah, that's not going to help. Um, 6 we already talked about because we got the 60 and 3, 30 and 60. 7 is not going to go in. Um, 8 goes in. Um, let's see, 180. Divide by 8. It, oh, no, 8 doesn't work. Uh, 9 we've got. Uh, 10. We got 10 and 18. Um, 11 won't work, but 12, um, 12 goes in 15 times, and 12 plus 15 is 27. If we make them both negative, then we get the negative 27 that we wanted. 
So it's going to be w minus 15 and w minus 12. So we get that w is 15 or w is 12. And the reason we're getting two answers here is because there's two dimensions. Um, there's a length and a width. So in the shorter side one, you just want to put 12 and in the longer side, 15. Um, so one of the dimensions is actually the length and one of them is the width.